Hey you guys, what is up? It is Jordan. My name is Jordan. I'm bringing you guys another video. This time it is not a vlog, but it is a Q&A session. So, um, I asked you guys, I think a couple of days ago, to send me some questions that you guys wanted or anything like that. Um, and I'm just gonna answer a couple of them right now. This will be a multi-part video because you guys blew up my Ask FM, so. And that, that'll also be in the, the description as well. So if you have any more questions or if you wanna get your question answered in another video or something like that, there's a link. <laughs> so let's jump right in. So question number one, let's go. Hopefully if I can scroll to the bottom of this since you guys overloaded my Ask of him. And so there's a lot of different ones. I'm gonna try to go in order and answer them. Um, I think this first part might have somewhere between 15 to 20 or 25. I don't know. And then part two and part three have many that I need to do. So let's go, question number one. What names do you want to give your children? Um, I don't want children. No, actually, if I were to have a son, it'd be a, or daughter, a son or daughter, it'd be Ben Tyler Cook. Question number two, let's see. What is your idea of paradise? Um, that's a good one. Definitely spicy food. I love spicy food clears up your sinuses, so I like spicy food. Um, Spider-Man is a must. Harry Potter is is a must. Not as a must as Spider-Man, but it's a must. Um, skateboarding, video games, sleep, and lemonade. And so I think that's my idea of, of um, paradise. Question number three, let's go. Have you ever tried to be vegetarian? Um, no. I couldn't do it. You have things like Chipotle holding me down. Bacon. Um, Thai food. I love Thai food. I mean, I guess you got vegetarian Thai food, but nothing like some teriyaki chicken or Krapow chicken from like a Thai dish, so. No, I can't. <laughs> question number four, qu question number four. All right, are you hardworking or lazy? That is a really, really good question. I don't even know if I can answer that. So whoever asked that, you you deserve a cookie and a gold star. But um, <clears throat> hardworking or lazy? I would definitely classify myself as hardworking, but probably lazy like as soon as I wake up in the morning I'm pretty sure everyone is like this I don't know everyone's different but um the first couple of hours that I'm up I'm definitely lazy I actually feel like a zombie or a vampire hitting the sun as soon as I wake up so probably the first hour or two that I'm up lazy but after that I'm pretty hardworking. but there's like a time and place for everything and so, but most of the time, majority of the time, it should be hard working. Hard working! Question number five, let's see. What is the most beautiful car? Definitely, in my opinion, a Gran Turismo Maserati. Definitely Google that. And I know there's different kinds, but I like all of the Gran Turismo, Gran Turismo uh, Maseratis. They're all nice looking. And hopefully one day I'll have enough money if I could stop spending it. <laughs> and go buy one but first I have to get my my driver's license so I don't know so hot in here <laughs> why is it so hot question number six what's the hardest part about being specs I think this one's for you oh uh, okay let me get in there um the hardest part about being specs is um,
<laughs> uh, the hardest part about doing specs is uh, the glasses. So um, at first it was really difficult for me to dance and to act with glasses on. I don't know why, but especially when it came to dancing, because I was always afraid of them falling off and things like that. But it's not too, it's not hard anymore because there's tricks to them. And, um, but yeah, it, it, it was never really too difficult. It was just something I needed to get used to. But it's, everything's all good now. <laughs> Question number seven. Does every newsie have a favorite fancy? I know, I don't think any of us do. I mean, I, I don't really have a favorite fancy. I like everyone equally. I try not to pick one over the other, so. Question number eight. How is the stage door every night? Do you sometimes get overwhelmed by the crowd? Sometimes, actually one time, I felt really, really overwhelmed. Um, but the stage door every night is different for the most part. Uh, some matinees are more full uh, at the stage door versus the night show and vice versa. But um, the only time that I was overwhelmed was our last day in Chicago. That was a lot. <laughs> madness, I tell you, madness. Question number nine. Yeah, number nine. How did you react when you saw you were casted as Specs? Is it a dream come true? They didn't tell me I was Specs until maybe the second. I don't know when they told me I was Specs because we started rehearsal and then like, we just learned all like the base material first and then I don't know, maybe like a week later, they were like, your specs. And I was like, whoa. And the only thing I could think about was Ryan Steele and uh, John Michael. So I was just like, whoa. To answer that second part of the question, it is a dream come true. Just being a Newsies in general is a dream come true. I've been trying to tackle the show for a long, 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 long time, so. Um, it definitely is a dream come true. Not just being specs, but just being a newsie in general. And I appreciate every part of it. <laughs> oh, I have another question. Question number 10, question number 10. So, do you take your glasses on? I know Ryan Steele did, so I was wondering. No, I do not tape on my glasses. Um, I think I tried in the very beginning, but I didn't like it, so I do not tape my glasses on. What I do now is that I just have my costumer, our costumer, uh, just tighten tighten the screw at the front, really, really at the base, the front of the glasses. I have her do that really, really tight, and so they're not too like flimsy, and they're like really, really uh, supportive and. Uh, the word I'm looking for. Basically, they just don't bend. My mind is turning into mush right now, so. Sorry, not sorry. <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you for watching. This was my first Q&A, and I enjoyed it a lot. This will hopefully be the first of many, just like my vlogs. So, um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Like it if you like it, dislike it if you dislike it. Feel free to comment as well as subscribe, as all of those things help this channel grow. And so, I kind of look like a ghost when I did that. Ooh, I died. Um, but yeah, please do all that. Um, thanks for watching, and as always, I'll see you guys in the next one.